Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. This is Burns Hustles, where we turn side hustles into cash. So is Airbnb still worth it in 2024? Uh, for me it is. And uh, you can see with my cursor here how much I made between April 2023 and now, which is February 2024. Um, this is gross, of course, their expenses, and I've got a staff, but we've grossed over 5 million yen, uh, which is in Canadian dollars, about $50,000, I think. In U.S. dollars, it's about $40,000, I believe. So, um, and I work about three to five minutes a day for this amount of money. So, for me, it's very worth it. Again, as I've said in other videos, it wasn't always this easy. It was a lot of work to get it all set up. But once it's set up, this is what you get. This is pretty nice. We have two guest houses in Japan. So you need to check your local situation and make sure that uh, it's okay. Some cities, I think, have outright banned Airbnb, but maybe your city hasn't. So if it hasn't, uh, you can think about doing it or even do it in, in another city. Uh, January 2024, we have grossed 157,845 yen, and that is about $1,500, $1,500 Canadian. Uh, I don't know what, in US, maybe $1,300 approximately. $1,200. The yen is pretty weak against the U.S. dollar at the moment. Uh, January is not a big month for us, although New Year's is good, but um, January, December are not big months, so these are the totals. Uh, let's go back to... Let's go to August. Let's go down to August. So August uh, is our best month, and so here's one payment, 170,000, 160,000, 167,000, 191,000. These are all in August. So we ended up making over 800,000 yen just in August, grossing that. So that's about $8,000, $7,000 for one month. Uh, August and July are fantastic. So yeah. January is not as good. February is pretty bad usually, but even in February I'm getting a few bookings. So, um, is it worth it for you? I guess you have to decide that. We are not in a major tourist area, so uh, you don't have to be in a major tourist area, but you do have to be in an area that people sometimes travel to, but that would be that probably include most places in the world. We're near a major tourist area, so that's a good thing. So that's how we advertise ourselves, as being near a major tourist area. So if you're near a major city, you can advertise yourself as that, and you will get bookings. We tend to get the people who don't want to pay the really high prices right in the, the town. Uh, so we're a little bit outside. So people who um, maybe want to be away from the crowds, maybe want to save a bit of money, they book with us. But as you can see, you know, I've grossed over 5 million yen for um, not even a year, actually. That's April to February. So, yeah, I would think about it. Um, the problem with this kind of business, people like Dave Ramsey, who don't really don't know much, get me on my rant here. Uh, Dave Ramsey, who really doesn't know anything about Airbnb, seems to always advise people not to do it. Um, and most of your friends will advise you not to do it. Um, friends and everyone, they're, they're great. You know, you need your friends. But often people don't have the imagination that you do. So you need to kind of get away from that noise and decide for yourself if this is something you would like to do. Uh, if we listen to our friends or relatives, I think a lot of things would never get accomplished. <laughs> so, with all the love and respect that they deserve, you know, I don't mean to put down my relatives and friends, but 
Uh, you need to realize that people err to the side of negativity, err to the side of caution, and sometimes you need to go for it.